one of the best things about virtual reality when you have it is sharing it with people who haven't tried it before. Whoa. Oh my God. What? <laughs> this is a trip. Oh my God. So don't walk too far, don't walk too far. <laughs> Am I attached to something? Oh, that's not a real handle. Oh my God, it's so real. It's so real. Wow. This looks like a real porch. Like I'm, can you guys see what I'm seeing? Oh my God. What a trip. Push to move. Whoa. This moves. Oh my God. This is a trip. Wow. Um, I just want to turn around. <laughs> oh yeah, we're gonna. So you have to squeeze the controller to grab things. There you go. Oh, <laughs> that's hard. No, that is weird. I can almost feel it. Whoa, that's so weird. Yeah, I don't know what to write. I'd write everything bad. I'd better not do that. <laughs> This is the trippiest fucking thing. I don't know why I'm so, this is so real. Stay on your mat, stay on your mat. Oh yeah. <laughs> How, oh yeah, I just move. Oh shit. He's just having fun. <laughs> I can see how you get motion sickness. Alex, how's it looking up there? Oh shit. Oh my God, this is so real looking. Holy sh... Is there like a mission you're trying to accomplish here? Do I get to kill people? <laughs> Interesting. It's kind of fun making a mess without having to clean it up. Oh shit. Oh. <laughs> this is a trap. Check out this area and then I'm gonna stop you here because I want to make sure you're staying staying good. I'm good, I'm not sick yet. <laughs> yeah, you your sickness may set in. It's the problem. I was trying to climb it. Can I climb it? Oh shit. God. Russell. They've got dad. I know. Oh, God. Fox! Alex, up here! You're gonna need a gun! Don't worry, it's unloaded. It's unloaded now! Oh, my God. And I hate heights. I'm going up an elevator. Tell us what you're seeing. Holy shit, this is my hell. <laughs> this is my hell. I don't like heights. Oh, God. I know it's not real. Oh my God, this is my hell. I f hate heights. Is it gonna disappear underneath me or something and I'm gonna fall? Don't push me off, James. What would happen if I fell? <laughs> oh my God. This is what it would feel like. Wow. I'm gonna turn around. <laughs> Sorry, <laughs> I just wandered off that thing. It's a trick, huh? Yeah, it's just not, it's not that realistic. <laughs> it seems like you would 
You want to be able to see your feet. Go ahead and step off. I was gonna. No, that's fun. Oh, and you die. <laughs> now we put you in Half-Life Alex, which is probably one of the best looking games right now. What did you think of the scene with the city and stuff? Was that still not it quite? It was pretty good, but it still was not quite what I think it's going to be soon. 3D to me I mean, though. It was 3D, I mean, but it was just not as realistic as. You're looking for photo realism. I want like real. You want to be convinced yes. that you're there. Okay. We're almost there. It's getting there. It was still fun. <laughs> That's pretty fun. That was fun. Yay! You played Beat Saber. And you seem to really like it. You talked about a little bit of the fitness side. What do you think? Would that be something you'd play or get a headset for? Oh, definitely, yeah. I, I think just for the workout aspect alone, I liked it for that. And you were picking up Beat Saber really fast. Well, that one was sick. The second one was pretty easy. <laughs> the one he played was pretty hard, so I would not have done very well. Well, funny thing, on the outside, you were saying you thought his was harder. Yeah, I thought his looked harder. Oh, on the... I don't know, I thought on the outside yours looked harder, but. With just three games that we got to try tonight, you guys didn't get to, to experience the full breadth of VR, but I'm wondering, first impressions, Drew, what did you think from what you started? It was a trip. I was impressed with how realistic it was. Doing the plank w felt really realistic, especially being afraid of heights. And... A little triggering there. What, what did you think, James? I'm more excited about the future. I didn't find it quite as realistic as I was hoping. I'm impressed, but I'm more intrigued of the future. So of the three games tonight, which one gets you most most interested in getting into VR? I was really interested in the three-dimensional stuff. I just wanted to tour around the city, so I think that one, the first game, got me to where I'd want to get into it. I think the thing that would make me get more into VR is when we're able to like have an entire like suit too, so I can actually grab my coffee and it's in the video, and I can sit at a table with my friend across and have a, vi a chat with her, okay. or a friend, or my grandmother, you know, I mean just full on, like you can be in a place where you could be in the Eiffel Tower and have a coffee together what when we're I... in a different city. If I was rich, I would definitely buy something okay. like that. I mean, if it was affordable for me, then I'd buy it. Well, we've got more. We're gonna have to try more out with you. You only got to try a little bit of it tonight. I think uh, I was awesome to see your reactions. Drew, you had a little hard time with your balance there in the beginning. What was going on? Yeah, I definitely could see how you could get motion sickness with that. Um, I think if I had gone a little longer in that game, I definitely would have gotten a little nauseous. Well, I want to say thank you for both of you coming out. My favorite part is showing off people their first time, getting to see their reactions. It was absolutely hilarious watching both of you and getting to see you go through the process. So thank you so much for coming out, hanging out with us here on the channel tonight. We will see you in another reality. You were, I thought you were going to fall. And then at the end of Richie's plank, when you tried to jump off the plank, oh my gosh, I was like, oh, I should have moved the keyboard. I, I, was, I was worried we were going to catch a serious fail on video there.